need. There he is, the Mexican in close. Here we go. The 1,000 meters for men's sprint, first semi-final. And already we see a pattern developing. Colombia leading the way. There's Daniel Zapata together with uh, Giuseppe. Well, actually, it, it looks like Samiente is uh, in uh, second place as well. But um, number 20 is David Ariel Samiento. And leading the way, the train develops. They take a little bit of uh, responsibility, but it is essentially a sprint race. And once again, Duccio Marsili, I haven't mentioned Simon Olbrecht yet, but he uh, did so well last World Games. Marsili from Italy is there. Zapata from Colombia, together with Jimenez. 600 meters gone. And there, three quarters of the competition. One more lap to go. And now you'll watch the Colombians explode. They'll work together. There they go. Zapata and Jimenez together. And watch Jimenez come through as well. And Duccio uh, Marsili, Duccio Marsili is now in great, great position. But that is a really comfortable finish from Mauricio Jimenez. Andres Mauricio Jimenez, Duccio Marsili. That's exactly what we expected there. Hope that Marsili and Albrecht there came up in the third place from Germany. And, uh, well, you have to say, it went according to form. Jimenez Torres. A gold yesterday and the uh, a, a, a silver. Duccio Marsili also a gold and silver. And they were first and second in this uh, first of the men's sprint semifinals. And it was a, a good Colombian start. Uh, but Zapata lost his way a little bit. Well, maybe that was planned. But uh, he... He was three seconds slower in the preliminaries than his uh, compatriot, Jimenez. Jimenez was looking behind him. Where are you? Where are you? He didn't bother to stretch. He didn't need to. Duccio, again, from Italy. Let's have a look. Marsili, 124.449. Well, that is a little outside his best, that's for sure. But... Uh, Marsili and Albrecht, they should be making the finals. We've got the other semi-final to run, but guaranteed that um, Andre Mauricio Jimenez will certainly be there. And there is Bart Swings. He is absolutely a legend. And uh, also the French Ivan Sevillier. Even Sevillier, Bart Swings, there you go. Bramante from Italy as well. Martinez from Mexico. Michael Probkop from the Czech Republic. Ricardo Christopher Verdugo, we've seen him a few places. And also Chinese Taipei's Kuo as well. Kuo Li Yang. Never discount the, Chin the Chinese Taipei athletes. Here we go, then second semi-final. This will resolve the finalists in just a couple of moments. They're all away, first time. Into the front there goes Ivan Silvillier. Strides beautifully, gets into rhythm. The lean is there nicely. And again, they are not squeezing, not uh, stretching too much. Silvillier from Swings. Swings has now taken over at the front there. The Belgian athlete done a great job. We know how good he is at timing everything, and you can feel his confidence. He just got a really great way of performing. And uh, Giuseppe Bramante is doing a great job in second place as well. And holding on to third at the moment is uh, Ivan Sevillier of France. So it swings Bramante, Sevillier. Verdugo's getting dropped a little bit here, but... Uh, Coming up to the front this time is Bramante, Giuseppe Bramante. The bell goes, but watch out for swings of Bramante. Bramante's on the inside. Swings is now 
in a great attacking position. He comes around the outside and there, whoa, just one more bend to go. And he overtakes, he just absolutely perfect timing. And just look at him, Bart swings. He is absolutely superb. Brant swing, uh, gr he absolutely, Bart Rene swings, 123.934. He has qualified. Ramante has also qualified. And this is interesting because it looks like the only guys to qualify from the first. I'm just looking at my uh, computer screen at the moment, and I tell you, that looks very, very interesting. It was a fantastic uh, qualification in that second heat. Our second uh, qualifier semi final. Bart Swings was 123.934. And uh, Bramante and Sevillier pushed that uh, pace brilliantly to get under 124. The only one to qualify at the moment I've got is uh, Andreas Maurizio Jimenez from Colombia. Actually, and Marsili actually with the Albrecht as well. So the top three from the first semi final qualified. And the top five from the second semi final qualified. So that's a, a really, really interesting. That was the result of the second semi final. Bramante push swings all the way. Huela Cabello from uh, Spain also got into qualifying for the final, as did Verdugo and Ivan Sevillier. Well, the